guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video I am gonna do a skincare routine video I'm not doing no makeup it's just strictly about skin I've been having a lot of requests asking me how I do my skincare routine or if I could film a video for you guys so I was like what the heck I know I had filmed one like at the very beginning whenever I had started YouTube but I didn't really go into debt with it so I was like what the heck why not go ahead and film you guys a skin routine video just strictly about skin so here it is and I am going to be talking to you guys and showing you guys my morning and night routine so if you guys want to go ahead and see my skin routine and how I'm taking care of my skin go ahead and keep on watching Okay, so I just barely woke up, so that's why I look like a hot mess. Look at my hair. I had moved in last night, and I just slept with it, so it looks like a hot mess, but I really don't care. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the very first thing that I do in my skincare routine. So the first thing that I do use is going to be this soap. And this soap is a Savila. I was using one that Vena. Um, you can find this probably like at Walmart. I don't know. I purchased mine here at HEB here in Texas. The Vena one is really good too, but I just recently ran out. So now I'm using this one, the Savila. This one's really, really good too as well. And it's really cheap. I believe it's like $2 the most, I believe. So I'm going to go ahead and wash my face now. But I really think the one, the Avena, and this one um, has been helping with my redness. Because I don't know, if you guys have been with me ever since I started my YouTube channel, I've always complained about having my skin like really red. I still have it, but not as much. It's not really noticeable. So then you want to go ahead and grab a really clean towel. I'm sorry if my camera's like at a weird angle, but I have like the vanity right here and I really can't put the camera right here. So now that I'm done washing my face, I do like to apply this mask. This one's really, really, really good for the pores. It will seriously close down your pores. This one is kind of pricey, but whenever I say that it's really, really good and it does like cover your pores, it'll start closing them little by little. It's because I mean it. It's not because I want you guys to go and purchase because I'm not even getting sponsored for this shit. I use this maybe like three times a week. I'll usually use it Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. It also comes with this little brush. I'll just go ahead and take a little bit and then just start applying it all over my face. And I will let this sit for maybe like 10 minutes and then I'll go ahead and wash it off. Whenever I do apply this, like right here where I have the most pores, you can seriously start feeling whenever your pores start to close. So you just start getting like this pressure right there and then it starts getting like really, really dry. So once you see that everything's dried out, it's time for you to wash it off. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and I'll be right back. Okay, so once I have that done, the third thing that I like to do afterwards is scrub my face. And I really, really love using this one. This one's from Dr. Brandon. I don't know how much it is if you would go and purchase it off their website. I did receive this in my boxy charm maybe like two years ago. And seriously, it's lasted two years. Like, I only use this twice a week as well. This exfoliator is just so I can, I can rub off all those dead cells that I do have on my skin. I'll do this twice a week. And I like to scrub it for maybe like two minutes. And whenever I say that this thing leaves your skin feeling like super good, like pretty much it feels like you have like new skin. Every time I do go ahead and apply this, it just like, I just feel like this one does really like do the work. It like rubs off all the dead skin on top. That smells really good. I know it seems like I do a lot, but at the same time, like if you want to have like good skin, especially like me since I do my makeup, not every day, but every other day, um, I have to keep up with my skin. Not everything's going to go to shit. It's really important that you get your neck too, because I always apply foundation and you should apply foundation on your neck unless you want to be looking like two different colors. But it's really important for you to wipe off everything going upwards not downwards i don't know why they just say it's like good for the gravity and just start wiping like with water and then i do like to scrub my lips 
for people that like to wear especially matte lipsticks it's always good for you to scrub your lips if not every day every other day would be good and i really like this one this one's from lush cosmetics and i'm pretty sure they have a website but i do purchase this at the mall they do have a store inside the mall and everything's like organic everything's like super good and natural for you and they have really really good masks también. this one's actually edible like if you put it on like it says on here you can go ahead and just lick it off but i don't like doing that i don't know it kind of grosses me out but it looks like this it has little pieces of chocolate inside you guys can see and i'll scrub maybe for like a minute it smells literally like a chocolate bar and then i'll just go ahead and apply vaselina i just find it a lot easier and i think it works the best and then now i'll go ahead and tone my face the toner that i can seriously swear by it like i just love it so much i've tried so many toners and this one's like the only one that i've actually liked there was a time that I lasted maybe like three months with pimples like on this side of my cheeks like literally they were pimples and I've never actually had pimples in my life but during those three months like I couldn't even wear makeup like I'd wash my face I would do like so many like home remedies and shit like you know Mexicans like always try like home remedies but nothing would work so I was like what the hell I couldn't believe it dude I have makeup oh my god yeah, like seriously all my clothes is ruined because I always like I'm in a hurry and I'll just wipe down my brushes like my palettes and everything like with my shirts I don't give a damn I really really do recommend it for especially people that are you know fighting with acne and stuff I would seriously recommend this and you should use it twice a day if not you can go ahead and use it once a day but I think it would work a lot better if you would use it twice a day so you can go ahead and grab a towel or a cotton ball I think a cotton ball is better but I don't have any I'm gonna go ahead and use my towel and then just press it on your skin and then I'll just go ahead and apply my serum and this one's the one I'm using it has collagen and vitamin C really really good for your skin not just apply two to three drops this just helps me and I'm just like so used to it I like, always like to apply a little bit of Nivea lotion and this one's the more to dry skin just like to add like one cup first I'll rub it on my hands you always have to have nice soft hands as well that's part of your skin routine and then just on your face okay also i do take some vitamins for my skin hair and nails they're these um it is twice a day ever since i started taking these my hair has grown a lot more than usual like i used to have my hair long and then i cut it off i think like in high school like my sophomore year or something like that and i've struggled to growing it back and that's my fault too as well because you know i'm always coloring my hair i'm always burning my hair so i was like okay i'm not gonna do anything with it and i'm gonna go ahead and start taking vitamins so i bought these and they've actually helped a lot like with my skin as well my nails have been growing like crazy and then my hair is starting to look healthier than what it was so I do take those. I do go ahead and take this. It's from Herbalife. And it's a collagen beauty booster. So what it does, it helps me with my skin, my hair, my nails as well. But this one is like in a powder formula. Um, it's strawberry lemonade. It's actually pretty good. I'll go ahead and drink this once a day. I have it right here. I started drinking this because my cousins, I think it was like in December, or I don't remember when it was, but um, one of my cousins, her skin was like really, really pretty. It looked like so shiny and soft, and I was like, dude, what are you taking? She was like, I'm taking the Beauty Booster from Herbalife, and I was like, oh my god. Like, So I purchased it, and it's actually helped me with my hair as well. My skin, my skin especially, like, I don't know. I just think that 
in order for you to have nice skin you have to be good from the inside of your body as well it's not just the outside you know you do have to like you know eat healthier try to you know like of course you know you can like eat here and there you know like bad stuff but i think you do have to have your inside like cleaned out in order for your skin to start looking glowy as well. I will be having all these products linked below on my description box. So in case you guys do want to go ahead and purchase them or you guys want to go ahead and check them out, they will be down there. And for my uh, night routine as well, I do go ahead and start wiping my face down. That's what I do first. Um, I'm like really, really low on these wipes. I do purchase these at TJ Maxx and they're super good. And this one was $3.99 at TJ Maxx because if you guys do buy those uh, Neutrogena wipes or like any other wipes, like it has a little bit and they're expensive. I think they're almost like $5. So go ahead, you know, and wipe down my face with that and then I'll go back in and wash my face with the aloe soap or with the avena soap, whichever one I have. Okay, so I'm pretty sure every girl every night has to wash their body at least. I know I do. What I really do love to use to moisturize my body is a Cetaphil body wash. And this one's normal to dry, very sensitive skin. It will really leave your skin feeling like a baby. That's how soft and that's how good it's going to leave your skin. And then afterwards, I will go ahead and tone my face again with the same toner. And then I will go ahead and apply this one from Nixon. Looks like this. This is for the nighttime and I really like it because, I don't know, I just feel like ever since I started using this, um, my face wakes up a lot cleaner, a lot clearer. It does exfoliate as well and it reduces the redness on your face. So I really, really like this. I always apply this at night. Last but not least, I will use my lotion. No matter what, after everything that I've used, I will go ahead and use my Nivea lotion. I don't know, I just really, really like this lotion. And like say like if I'm on my period or I do have like a pimple for some reason and you know it's like ready to pop or you know it's just like red. I always go ahead and apply this little treatment as well and this one's from Nixon. I kid you not guys, like I seriously kid you not. Um, the other day I had a pimple right here. You can still kind of see, you know, like the little bump, but it was like pretty much ready to pop. Like it had the little white tip and everything and I put it on and the next morning I woke up and it was pretty much gone. Like the whiteness, like I just have the little bump now. It doesn't even hurt or anything. That's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. I know my hair was looking crazy, but I had just woke up. But I really hope I went into debt with my skin routine information. And if you guys have any questions, go ahead and comment below. And I would be glad to answer all of your questions. Also, if you haven't subscribed already to my channel, don't forget to subscribe to my channel before you guys do exit my video. And hit the little bell to get notified every time I do upload a video. And I hope to see you guys on my next video. Bye, guys!